Hey everybody, I'm sorry Glenn, just call me Glenn, and we're back to more Final Fantasy. Last time we went to the Waterfall Cavern and it's near infinite random encounters. And we came back to Crescent Lake. What were we here? Oh, right, I wanted to get exit. Because this is a very useful thing. Um. So we're just gonna... We have to go back to Onrak, which is oop, right here. So it would technically be faster to go um, southeast. Because this world actually loops. Okay, let's check where I'm at. Okay, we're right about that continent. Okay. The only bad part is I gotta walk all the way there. Where is the closest? Right here. Again, you get an airship. You can go anywhere in the world, yes! But you can only land on very s small pieces. Strips of land in the last continents. Come on. You guys really think you can take me on? I have staff. And he actually crit. Oh, he actually did a lot. What's that? 101 or 191? I didn't see it. I go inside the one eye and look like 191. I might have been wrong. Oh, great. There it is. Where's it? Jeez, I hate these things. Really high attack and really high defense. But I think their max defense is like nothing. I literally took two steps. I just killed your brother within earshot of you. Like, seriously? Uh, sure. I can rest here. I just killed your friend within earshot. Your friend, brother, whatever. You should be- you should fear me. Fear... The party. I didn't have a good one I always hate it when, when games make me name something, because I'm like, I don't know! Like in Persona 5, when they're like... Name the Phantom Thieves! I'm like... I didn't put any forethought into this because I didn't know this was going to be a thing, so I just named them dragons. Still haven't made it very far that game. I only just visited Mementos because I've been doing a lot of different games at a time. I've been doing this, my streams, I've actually been drawing a lot more lately because I've been having fun drawing. How much money do I got? I've anyway, been drawing a lot more. I've been um, playing Dark Souls 3 alongside Persona 5 and 1.5 and 2.5 because I gotta get all the trophies for those again. There's supposed to be a way I'm supposed to go here. Um, let's actually rest the end first. That'd probably be a smart idea before I do this. I'm also probably going to need a bunch more high potions to heal in the dungeon. Maybe some more ethers to restore MP. Because that'll be a thing. I'm still going off of the strategy guide that I have found. So, I'm pretty sure the next dungeon is a sunken shrine in the next crystal. I am like level 40. I think I'm prepared for this. Then again, you see, it's pretty typical if you play a, your chapel, you play a f Final Fantasy game, you're usually going to end up somewhere in your, somewhere in like your 50s to 60s to, I think at the very most, 
it would be like, or not 56, you're somewhere between high 40s to mid 50s. And I think in most, like, if you go any higher than that, you're usually going to only go into your 60s. So, I have, oh, I can buy cottages, but they're expensive. Um, gold needles, because I got rid of Stona, those are going to be neat. And you can finally buy remedies. But look at this. Cure status ailments except stone and KO. So you still need either stone or gold, ne gold needles. They're kind of expensive too. I'm gonna buy a bunch of these. Should probably just buy more. Just in case. Because they actually cure paralysis. How, long, how many hours are we in this game? We are about 14 hours of knowing what we're doing and going straight where we need to go. With just a little bit of grinding. So if you just sped run this game, this would probably be like 12 hours-ish. Probably take off an hour or two or maybe even three. And you just finally got a method with which to prevent um, paralysis. Or to heal it. I forget exactly where I'm supposed to go to stop. There is a spot with a barrel. Is it here? No. I'm gonna follow that bridge. Wait, I can go through here. Do I, can I go out that way? Let's see. Oh, there's a dragon again. Oh yes, I can go over here. Okay. I want to talk this up there. 200 years ago, the shrine of Onrak flourished. It brimmed with the power of water. I ask you, I ask but one thing of you, please, restore that power to its former grace. Yeah. Not Shrine of Onrak, but now it's called Sunken Shrine. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to... Because I am one of those compulsive people who always make a save file outside of the dungeon. And one inside of the dungeon. In case I get in there, get too far and realize, oh crap, I'm not prepared, I can go back. You, you have Oxyale. You are the ones I've been waiting for. Please save the mermaids. Oh god, she can fly. She's a ghost. Well then. Hi, my name's Cop. Hmm? You want to hear about the shining object I saw? I think it came down somewhere near the waterfall to the north. No one believes me, but I think it was some kind of mechanical creature. Yeah, this tells you if you haven't been here yet, go to Waterfall Cavern and because there's a robot. Do you want to get in the barrel? Yes. So this is the sunken, sunken shrine, where the water crystal is. Fun fact, notice the music. The music is Chaos Shrine, which plays while you're in this dungeon. On the soundtrack, if you look at it, it's number 13, I think, on the PS1 version soundtrack, and number 10 on the NES version. There's a song called Sunken Shrine, which does not play here. It plays in the final dungeon of the game. But for some reason, they call it Sunken Shrine? I don't know. I never really figured it out. There is no, no water. Water isn't really a big element. Let's see if I can actually use, use it, or if Matt just kills him first. Oh, that did ton of damage. Well, I didn't even get to cast any magic. Oh, I actually leveled up. Uh, ooh, it's good MP. Deku got some good MP too. Awesome. No one's getting good HP, but they're getting good MP. Ooh, Matches actually got a good HP. Where's he at? Oh! If he kept getting like two more levels like that, he'd break 400. 
The white wizard still has more HP than the ninja. Squishy ninja. It's almost like I should just switch their positions. If it wasn't for the fact that Deku has higher defense because he can equip higher defense items. Wait. Why do you have 26 and you have 17? What? Oh, because you have the ruby armlet. Yeah, that's why. Okay. Well. Just gonna explore a little bit. 2,000 gil. That is one cottage to me right now. <laughs> like, I don't know why they give chests with so little gil, like, at this point in the game. Because, I mean, it's like, I can do that and I can get one remedy. Or, one remedy and some, and, like, a gold needle. Or I can just get, like, one cottage. Did I buy cottages? No, I didn't. Uh, not that it really matters. Because I can't use cottages in a dungeon. I think you'd be too afraid of being murdered by the monsters to use a cottage in the middle of a dungeon. I mean, later games, I think four. Yeah. S SNES onwards, so four, five, six have like. Sea Troll, Sea Scorpion. They have save points, which are safe areas for people to rest. And they're actually called that. They're called safe area. Like. It's part of the game. It's like, oh, these are safe areas so that monsters don't come and completely kill you while you're sleeping. I'm still... There's still a lot of enemies. I think that's one of the only bad parts just have to worry about random encounters being so... I don't remember how many floors this place is either. I want to say it's five. Most of these dungeons, or these crystal dungeons, have come to five. If this one's not like eight or something bigger. Um I don't know if there's any more rooms this way. Down stairs. I know for a fact that like um the last dungeon for the Crystal Flying Fortress is actually gonna be really long because you have to get through the Mirage Tower. And once you're through the Mirage Tower you to the Flying Fortress, which is about I think five floors in of itself. Which one is just a bridge that has the death machine on it? Then I, I, I still feel like that thing's just gonna come and ruin my day. Just eventually, it's gonna be like, hi, and kill me. Game, I think you got this wrong. These guys aren't white; they are purple. These are purple sharks. They're purple. Is everything weak to ice here? It might be because, you know, water freezes. I know, so you, what do you have? You have Defender on, so... Ice Brand is slightly weaker. Uh -huh. But Defender casts Blink, so I'm gonna keep it. Because Blink is useful. It's always useful. I mean, not really in random encounters, but... On bosses. I don't think there's a blink ra. I don't think there's this Proterra, there's Invisera. Uh, but I don't think there's a, br a blink ra to target everybody at once. But there is. I think this is the dungeon they're in. I think this is the dungeon with the giant's gloves. Meaning, I want to find those. So we're gonna be. Doing a bit of searching for chests. Like, how you saw, even if I find the stairs, I'm gonna explore a little bit. Because Giant's Gloves cast Saber when used, meaning you can have two people cast, or two people doing Saber a turn. And as well as the fact that Saber and Temper stack, I think. I don't know, I always done both. It's helpful. If not, Saber and Haste stack because they do two separate things. Ooh, there's a door.
Your puny attacks mean nothing to us. Now die. <laughs> I like how that battle went. Zero. 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 Miss. Dead. Seriously? You were wanting to ambush us, weren't you? Ooh, just... You, I don't think, are what I'm looking for, but I'm still open. Up, oh, crap. I was keeping track of how many times I did that. So how is everybody doing? Okay. <laughs> Let's actually do this the right way now. <laughs> Oh, they actually hurt us, though. Well, they only hurt Sola matches, and it wasn't much. It was like six, two, six. I need to find another ruby, ruby armlet, or I need to find a place to buy another one. So that I can give one to Sol, because she's important to keep everybody alive. I gave it the matches because she's squishy. Seriously, why 20, girl? Why are there so many of you? Come on, run. Run for the Sahagans. Stop trying to run from fights in the new dungeons. Old dungeons are fine, and it's the new dungeons that are such a pain. You know what I just realized? Okay, yes, yeah, so I'm in the right profile. I just kind of sat there like I might be in the wrong profile, being it's recording fairly bad quality. <laughs> uh, like what streams? I mean, 360p isn't the bad quality. It's just the fact that I have to have the bitrate so low, otherwise it tends to not want to work. Is what upsets me about streaming, because the when my bitrate's low, there's too much action, then it literally just blurs everything to compensate. And I hate that. I wish I could record it like separately. I don't know how to do that, but if I could, like, record, like, everything separately, then what the streaming was recording, it would work a little bit better. I still wouldn't record very high quality, because I feel like uploading it in a night. Deep Eyes! You just gotta despise those Deep Eyes. Even though they die like everything else. Seriously, game. And this is the one big problem we're going to come into now that we're this far into the game. There are going to be a lot of random counters. Diamond armor! You can't equip it. You can't equip the bunch of... Why did I not give you better armor? Aww. Flame mail. That's actually pretty good for you. And it doesn't drop your evasion that far. Yeah, let's give you that. But you can have the diamond armor. Doesn't lower evasion for being like, you know, heavy old diamond. But increases defense by 8. Still have not found giant's gloves. That is a major goal of mine. I think it might be on a later floor, like floor four or something. I'm gonna have to give matches uh, on either sometime soon. I need to 
figure out, like, I think I'm at the highest match level for the knight and ninja, so I need to figure out if they go any higher. Oh, matches is almost dead. Deku's already behind. We don't need matches falling behind. Ah, okay, let's see. Three, four, yeah, they didn't go up. Okay, so I think they're stuck there. I'm at least gonna keep recording till I find the next set of stairs. Oh, I just went up that way. So I gotta record and then I wanna do some other stuff before work. A living doing something. Now I work at customer service, so I get to deal with all the rude people who think they're better than you, and then you prove them wrong. There was a guy I had last night who was just very rude to me. Like, just very, very rude. And then he tried to use his debit card, and his pin was wrong every single time. So his pin never worked. So I'm like, ha ha, karma. Be rude to me, your pin don't work. Okay. No! Oh, light axe. I don't think this does anything. Can you equip it? Yeah, you can. An axe that casts Dira when used. Uh, but it's not stronger for me. Staff, good attack power, I don't need that. Uh, we do have the healing staff, which casts the minor heal. There is a couple items I want. I want to find, I think they're in the main game. I want to find the judgment staff and the giant's gloves. Because they can be used as items. I think the judgment staff casts flare. Which is nice, because that means I don't have to waste the MP on Flare. And... Giant's Gloves, of course, cast Saber. Which lets me not waste each MP on Saber, but also lets me do two Sabers in a turn. So there's next stairs. Alright, well... I... It's a mermaid. Oh, my prayers have been answered! Is that all you gotta say? It's not like we came to save you. We just, we're just strolling through here. We happen to get a body of oxy, a bottle of oxy ale, and we're just like strolling through this place. We're just exploring, and steal all treasure. We're not here to rescue you. If the light of the sea is lost, we will turn into sea foam, vanishing forever. So you just turn into bubbles. Nine thousand, seventeen, diamond armlet. Okay. I'm sorry, matches. It is 10. Well, it is better than what you have, but... I want to give it to Soul. Because Soul can bring you back to life, can't she? I'm pretty sure I taught her life. Yeah. Soul can bring you back to life. So... Don't get jealous. Did I talk to you? No, I didn't. One of her friends has went to see the world above and hasn't returned. I wonder what she's doing now. I hope she's alright. I think she just disappeared. I think she was a ghost. She's dead. How can you breathe underwater? How? How? I got a bottle. Let's go. Okay. This floor is pretty simple. No random encounters. Just talking to people. So I'll go ahead and do it. Save the sea. Did I just say save the sea? Save the sea. Restore light to the water crystal. Are those the crystals the legends speak of? Just who are you? A guy who came to steal your chest. You're welcome. There's a lot of just gill on this floor. I need better treasure. While the fiend of water lives, the light of the sea grows ever darker. Okay. This is the uppermost level of the shrine. 
The Kraken, the fiend of water, nests on slowest level. Okay. So we gotta go back down. The Mirage Tower stands in the desert on the continent to the east, right? Well, I saw someone go into the tower. I remember hearing the most lovely chiming sound. I don't think that's it. There's some kind of chime we need to get. We'll get it later. Hand it out. Use this. That poison up. And a diamond shield. I will take that, though. Uh, can you equip it? No, you can't. It's too heavy. It's too heavy for you to use. Alright. Well, that'll be all for now. I gotta find a way to get back down again. Uh, because... Gotta find a way to get back down because... Kraken's on the lowest level. But anyway, thanks everyone for watching and see you!